Alrighty, what's going on, everybody? So what you're going to have to do, if you are currently running a pre-search node through Flux Apps, to update the monthly uh, subscription for it, right, the one Flux, what you're going to do is you're going to log in to your Flux app. So you can see here, all I've done is just the IP address. So when you set up that Flux node, um, whatever internal IP address you had. So in my case, it's 192.168.50.138. And then it's running through port 16126. If you've got a second one like I do, it'll the second one will be its own IP address running through 16136 through 4656, depending on how many nodes you're running. So on this one here, the first thing I have to do is uh, I have to uh, sign into Zellcore, right? So click right here on the Zell ID. You're going to open up Zellcore. And when it opens up, we're just going to log into it. All righty. And what we're going to do, I'm going to bring this over here. There we go. We'll do that like that. All right. So I'm going to log into my Zellcore. Uh, the next thing I need to do, throw my pin in and we are signed. You're going to see now appear that uh, successfully logged in. So you're going to run over to the app store. You're going to go to global apps. Okay. And then from there, what you need to do is go to my apps. So in my apps, you can see I have my pre-search node. And uh, when you click manage, go to manage app, it's going to tell you the expiration of your, um, of your pre-search, I guess, node for that. So come up to update specifications. All right. And in my case here, uh, I'm actually, let's look at it here. Hold on. So expires at block height 1140959, which is... I mean, right where we're at. Okay. So 959, and you can see that we're currently at 725. So I'm, I'm about 200 blocks away, 200 blocks every two minutes. Um, it'll probably be less than 12 hours, right? From when, uh, when this is going to expire. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to come over to again, global apps, go to my apps, manage. All right. And then what you're going to do is come over to update specifications, right? update specifications, you're going to hit compute update message before the expiration. Now, if this happens afterwards, you just restart it again. All right. And what you need to do from here, okay, is you need to update, hit update flux app. Oh, I'm sorry. You need to first sign in with your Zellcore ID. All right. Hit open Zellcore. It's going to ask you if you want to sign the message, you're going to hit sign message, sign and send message signed. Then you're going to hit update Flux app. Okay. So it's propagating the message and then it's going to now tell you as soon as this pops up. Okay. So now it's going to tell you to finish the application update, please make a transaction of 0 0.26 Flux to this address. So what we need to do is we need to come right here. We're going to copy that address. I'm going to come over to, uh, I'm going to do it through my mining uh, one. I'm going to send I'm going to send that 0 0.26 flux, right? So what we're going to do is we're going to send it to that address, right? That I just copied with the following message. So I need to send this message right here. Okay. Um, with that following message, 0 0.26 flux, right? So 0 0.26 flux, right? Which comes out to about 15 cents. And you can see the transaction must be mined by June 11th at 1125. All right. So uh, just about... 13 hours, the application will be subscribed until July 11th. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, in just the payment under memo, I'm going to paste this just in case I need it. <clears throat> there we go. And I'm going to send that 0.26 flux. All right. It's going to charge me a fee of not even a traceable amount of flux. And I'm going to just verify that everything is good. I'm going to hit send. And while this is sending, we can see that flux node has been sent. And then I have that transaction ID that I can look in the store. It'll take, um, you know, I'm guessing maybe like three, four minutes for it to happen. And then we're golden, right? That is all that you need to do to update your 
pre-search node to pay the monthly fee. Now I have, I have seen in the Flux Discord that the um, development group is working, the dev team is working on simplifying the process um, so that potentially you can pay, you know, in advance, you could stack up payments or hopefully they can just do it where it's automated. You know, um, I can, they've already got the uh, wallet address for where my payments are coming from. Um, you know, hopefully maybe like five minutes before, 10 minutes before the expiration, they'd all just automatically conduct like a, a transaction. So we'll see, but that's how it's going to go. Um, I'll update, you know, I'm not going to sit on here and, and wait for the update, but I will add in at the end of the video here, just a quick little how long it took uh, for everything to go through. All righty. So thanks again for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video.